So what is going on guys? This is Ryan here and welcome back once again to some more Thief Simulator. We are back once again guys to continue our adventure into becoming the most prolific thief of this area. Now if you guys haven't seen the previous three episodes, which are, you probably should by now, we've been learning a load more techniques to get the more valuable resources and it has been paying off as time goes on. We're now at a level guys where I think the first thing we gotta learn is how to crack a safe, so uh, you already know I'm about that. And then really we're just gonna do the same thing. Uh, if I could give a visual demonstration, we're just gonna continually steal things from people and um, keep this going and then we'll climb the ranks even more so let's do it for the last episode guys the likes that came in again were absolutely insane we're kind of sitting this challenge where we're trying to up the ante with every single episode you see the number there guys okay if we can match that okay. that would be cool or how about we gave a night so welcome back anyway guys to my humble abode i guess in this episode the first thing we're going to do is go ahead and learn lock picking skill level four and i think that's actually the final level of lock picking as well so uh yeah here it is right here then so lock picking level four open safe is safe is did i really just say that <laughs> open saves and also use the glass knife so then we can break him pretty much through any window into any apartment so that's kind of important i guess well the only thing we can do to level up guys i guess is get sneaking so i think i'm gonna rob 104 again because you know they're always out between 8 and 11. <sighs> easy pickings guys and also also, being a thief and having this much money, I probably should invest in a bed. Be real, guys. The more I sleep like this, the more my back kind of sounds like... Yeah, you know what I mean? Okay, so we're going to go over to 104. Now, I believe they're out between 8 and 11 a.m. So I've slept until 7, and this feels like the best time to obviously get it done. Because they're out between 8 and 11 a.m. Now, right, let's go ahead and pull up in the parking lot. That looks good enough to me. Morning, gentlemen. Morning. How's it going? Uh, how's it going, my dude? Blocking path? Like, I wanted to talk. All right. I'll... St wow. I mean, I just wanted to make a friend in this thing, you know, but okay. I'm gonna judge you silently, man. Look at those glasses. Look at that freaking comb back hair. It's like a freaking idiot, to be honest. I don't want to be his friend. All right. Anyway, guys, we're gonna get straight back into this. So we're gonna break through the house and see, I guess, what they've replaced since the last time. No doubt everything, by the way. Okay, let's go ahead and open this thing. I feel like I'm gonna try a few different things for this episode as well, being that we're now at part four. I kind of want you guys to experience, like, the high side of things a bit more in depth. You know what I mean? What I'm gonna be trying for this episode more specifically, guys, is houses that we've already, I guess, burgled. We'll do, like, the same amount of editing, but I I guess when it comes to like newer houses, I want you guys to experience it firsthand with me. And uh, by the way, 150. Right, and this one here. Okay, no luck. All right. So this guy had the weirdest bathroom ever. And it's one person that lives in here. So yeah, I really don't understand this setup you got going, man. And the old Yamaha guitar. Gonna go ahead and take that one. What else can we take around here? I've also learned another thing as well, guys. Like, you remember sometimes when I'd be, like, looting a house, no one's in it, but yet I still get caught? You've got to also be really wary of people on the streets who can actually see you through the window because they're always watching, okay? Which is kind of rude when you think about it. Like, they're always observing their surroundings. I mean, come on. Okay, we're going to go ahead and take the microwave as well. Now, I feel like I will take maybe one of the paintings with me as well. I mean, actually, the dude's got a TV, so I think we're going to take that instead. Okay, I'm in through. There is someone on the street, though I don't think they're going to observe me or really give a crap. I said in the last episode, guys okay we've just came from a house do some shit put that down i'm good right okay so let me get this straight okay if we drop the tv on the floor that is not shady but if we pick it up and carry it that is shady okay well we learned in the last episode that we probably should get the heck back out of here as well by 11 a.m so we do actually get caught so let's do this you go ahead take that crappy tv okay and all my other items okay we're gonna go ahead and sell everything that we got here that is a lot of cash right there and also probably enough to level up in fact no we're still level 10 guys i'll be right back Alright then guys, so we are now back anyway, and I think we can get the level up we need, which is lock picking level four. Open the saves and use the glass knife. Let's do it. Vinny, I need that call. What the freak is going on? Vin Vinny. Um Vin Vinny? I I I feel really alone, Vinny. Guys, I'm gonna go home. I don't like this. Vinny? Please call me. I, I kind of miss you, dude. I, I actually really miss you. I'm all alone on this one, guys. Okay, so we have to get the safe cracking tools. Let me see how much are they. 2.5k. That should be enough. Okay, guys, now I'm just saying I do feel slightly ripped off with that one, but I will get what I need. Okay, so the training safe. Safe cracking tools and also the level four in lock picking. Let's try and figure this thing out. So along the bottom, it says hold to rotate the direction shown by the arrows until the tone of the sound changes. Then carefully press the proper direction until the combination is accepted. After that, start rotating it in the opposite. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing. Let's just do this. Just start rotating. Listen for the sound. I guess. Ah. Uh, ooh. So 44. Okay, I keep doing this and I guess. So keep going again. I think it's automatic. Or we just let go. I think. Wait, I don't get it. What's going on? Okay, hold up. I will get this down, guys. Okay. So rotate it that way. Sound changes. Oh, okay. Now I get it. You gotta be really snappy with the ear, okay? And then switch up instantly. So swap up. Swap up. Bruh. Okay, too late again. This is really difficult. Dude, what is going on? Why is it why is it like spinning all the way around? I don't understand. So there. Alright. Gotta listen. This is hard. Alright. Making me nervous is free. Come on. Do the sound. Nope. What the freak? This is ridiculous. Okay, hold up. 
Different sound here. Keep going slowly but surely. There you go. So that's gonna be it, right? Guess Vinny's calling me, so... An important document has gone missing from Mr. Lombardi's desk. Mr. Lombardi, huh? I've got a feeling it's in Greenview 102. Dang. Be a good debt slave and check it out for me. Vinny, if you call me a debt slave one more time, I'm gonna burn that document and film it on camera, okay? Debt slave. Who the freak does he think he is? Actually, I guess he did kind of bust me out of prison, so... Uh... Okay, so before we even go ahead and check out 102, I'm gonna go ahead and investigate on the computer. What are their habits so we can get this as successful as possible on the first try? Okay, so we're looking for 102, and I don't even think it's on there, so that's good. Alright then, guys. Well, in that case, I suppose we're just gonna have to try and figure this thing out as we go. Oh, 102. We are gonna find that document that you've been stealing and sealing away. We're gonna give it back to Mr. Lombardi. Does that mean the whole town is kind of in on the same thing? Like, thinking about it, what are they doing with the document that I guess belongs to, like, the kingpin thief in the first place? So, are we about to steal from the stealer? And then I gotta think, do two wrongs truly make a right? And it sounds like it probably is gonna be the case. Anyway, let's think in more thieving, okay? That's what we're here to do, and that is what we are going to do. So, 102, this house on the left-hand side here. <gasps> doing well for themselves, okay? Mostly thieves live in houses like that, I'm just saying. I'm gonna pull up in the woods right here. Let's do a little bit of scoping right now. Gotta see, I guess, what we're dealing with, and, uh, yeah, I've got my doubts. However, though, guys, that is a good thing, you know? We gotta learn new tricks of the trade, and I guess try and figure things out the more we go. So a climbable fence. Hop on over. Let's try and do some scoping out, then. Can we see anyone nearby the residence? And what the heck is this? Don't you dare! No! Okay, I'm gonna back up real quick. So, there's the document. Okay, duck, 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 duck. Someone outside. You see, you gotta be super careful like that. That's how you can get snapped up. So, let's try and find, I guess, if anyone's home, because that's the biggest concern right now. Mm. The heck? Is that true? So, can I mark him through the wall? Okay. Bro, what the freak are you doing? Throwing hands? There's another person just like here. Bro! Oh, this is hard. This is gonna be really difficult. What? The resident himself has the gun. That basically confirms all of my suspicions, okay? This guy is a thief as well. Dude, look, you need the front door key for that thing, okay? Can I mark the person through the wall? Dang it, I can't. Mm, this is gonna be difficult. Okay, so we know that there's two people home definitely right now. We sneak underneath the windows. There's gotta be some way to enter this place. Or do I really need the glass cutting knife? Glass knife again. Dude, this doesn't look good. I got a bad suspicion. Yeah, I'm gonna need that glass knife real soon. There is no other way in this place whatsoever. No matter where I look. God dang it, dude. That sucks. I mean, I guess I'll steal the headphones at least whilst I'm here, I guess. <sighs> I really wanted to get this heist done, though. I guess we can't. Okay, at least we've got this door open right now. Hmm. Do they have a hidden key anywhere outside? That's also another thing I'm thinking about. Come on, let me mark the tenant. There we go. So there's at least one tenant marked. That's good. That means I slightly know their routine. Now I need to see the other one. What? So if it goes past not- Dude, they locked down their house. Okay, so there goes one. Okay, let me try and avoid that. She's just left the house. Let me see a sec. Okay, she has completely disappeared. Do they both leave at this time? Hang on a sec, so try the door. Of course it's gonna be locked. I could ring it, and then I guess maybe sneak in. So if I back up now, guys, I don't know what I'm doing right now. This is ridiculous. Let me just get a nice peek action right now. Is anyone gonna answer? Hello? Is anyone even home right now? Um, hello? Pizza? I'm telling you guys, there is something really shady about this property, okay? Why would you need to install shutters in every single one of your windows during night time? You don't trust someone. Someone's got some trust issues, okay? Especially when they're sleeping and have no guard of what's going on behind their back. That's kind of concerning. Well, I guess we can't do that heist at the minute, though. We definitely need the glass tool. So, I guess we're just gonna have to go ahead and make some more money. Okay, so looking at this as well, from the tenant discoveries, we know that they're both out just after 9pm. But all of the shutters come down by that point, so we have to have the key to enter the door. You know what I think I'm gonna do in the meantime? I'm gonna go back to my home. There was another section on the website where I think you can do, like, jobs such as, like, breaking a toilet, stealing some paintings, things like that. That's maybe what we need to do to level up and get this one done. In the rent a thug tab here, and you see the most important thing is, I guess, getting as much money as we can. 106, 107, and 108. These are all things I feel like I may as well accept, because there's a lot of cash in this, okay? In fact, I'm just gonna go ahead and accept more, why not? Well, I guess with the knowledge of basically destroying everything that these three houses have here, let's just go ahead and do it and see how much money we can make from doing so. I think the first house I'm gonna go for is 106, and I think as I'm pretty much getting stuff done, in fact, you can just see it all. That's gonna be so easy. All right, so go ahead and enter the first property. Come on, you know you wanna. Let's do it. Yes! And there we go. I don't think anyone's in, and even if they are, I'm about to break everything in your house. Okay, okay, and someone's here. This is really bad. This is actually, like, uh, really bad. All right, so your dishes, uh, yeah, they're kind of gone. Okay, I should probably hide in the meantime. That's a good idea. Close the door. Bro, I have nowhere to hide. This is so bad, okay? Let me try and get my away. If I, like, just... Bro, 
If he knows I'm- uh? Freeze! How do they know exactly where you are, like, instantly? That's kind of BS. Okay, so change of plan. I'm gonna scope the place out. Where? Is the bedroom. Is it like down here? Okay, so there's the bedroom. So basically, guys, I'm gonna smash the house up and then go ahead and hide. Wait, I can't hide in that bedroom. Uh, okay, this house kind of sucks then. Let me mark the tenant. Can I mark them? I guess I can't to a wall, which kind of makes sense. Bro, are you picking your backside? I see that. Okay, so she sits there. You know what? I'm gonna get out of the house. Okay, first of all, I'm good, okay? I close the door, I'm fine. Go ahead and check out the routine. I'm walking, and you say I'm blocking the path. How freaking arrogant do you want to be? These people, now let me pick a lock in peace. Okay, so what we need to do is this, I think. And there you go. Okay, I'm gonna get really far away. Surely they're not gonna just, like, straight lock onto me here? Because that doesn't really make any sense. Okay, I don't think they can find me. I'm looking at the little radar thing in the bottom corner, and I'm not in their line of sight. So we'll just keep this going, and then we should be okay. And there we go. We're all good already. Nice. Well, I say that. Actually, they're still patrolling, right? I hear the sirens? Uh, are you guys done? Because, like, there's no thief here anymore? Why are the cops still searching? Like, are they just gonna keep doing this? Because this is kind of annoying, you know? When you hide under the bed, you literally drop the rank straight away. So, wh why is this happening? This is so weird. Can they stop? I don't get it. I'm gonna hide. I guess this will make them go away or something, I guess? Okay. So, you sit in a trash can, and then they decide to disappear. Perfect. Okay, whilst them here, hold up. Can I mark the tenant? There you go. So now I can figure out her routine, and that's a good sign. Leaving the door wide open for me, pal walking downstairs. All right, let's do this. I mean, I know they're going to hear the noise, but I don't care by this point. So yeah, smash that. They don't hear it. Okay, this is good. I don't care about that too. Okay, nice. I'm going to get the freak back out of here. All right, that was successful. That was really good. Next thing then is 105. I think there's something just behind this wall here. They are sleeping, so that's okay. What are we doing in here though? Break their toilet and break or steal their TV. So, okay, we'll smash the toilet. Wait, I didn't get the quest done for that? So I just did that for no reason? I mean, it's fine. I would have done it anyway, but I'm just saying. Oh, wait, that was 104. That was 104 I just did, guys. Uh, who saw me? Okay, the person over the road. Let's go ahead and get this done again. Okay, so we're through there. So two things we got to do in total. Let's go upstairs and I guess go from there. It's going to be much easier to go ahead and break this thing. There you go. There is someone in. They're downstairs at the moment. Do I risk going down, you know? That's what I'm concerned about. Wait, they're going to save. Should I try it? I, I don't know, dude. This is sketchy, because if I get caught... Oh, man! Come on, we learned the skill. Let's go ahead and do it. We can just stop, I guess, if it gets too risky. Come on. This is clutch, though. I'm actually feeling the tension from this. Come on. Got to be close. There. Come on. Click. There you go. Okay. So, I messed it up there. Okay. Now, the other way. Okay. We're close. There you go. And then the other way. Got to be close. Got to be getting there. Here we go. Come on. Pop, baby. Pop. Come on. There. So, that's it. We're open. What's in there? Jewelry. Oh, man. That's where the money's at. I'm just gonna take everything. Look, guys, this has been so successful. Okay, I'm done. Actually, $50. I'll take that. Candle holder. Look, guys, no one saw nothing, so I'm out. Now, I'm interested. What will it say about my ranks and stuff like that? I fuck. I got, I got an F. I had to get an F for, like, the most successful heist I've ever done, okay? Guys, look, if I disassemble that, that's gonna be worth so much, okay? So get rid of everything else, I guess. <sighs> it's the hard life of a criminal, though, guys. Uh, I'm just saying. Would not recommend this line of work for anyone, okay? It's, uh, it's pretty tough out here, you know? Oh, yeah. And the third one right there. Okay, let's go ahead and sell this crap. Wait, wh why is it still worth 1200 wh Why did the value not proceed to go up? At all. I guess you can take it, I guess. Uh, guys, I just got bamboozled by that dude, didn't I? Okay, so now we should have enough, I think, for the glass knife, so that's good. Let's go ahead and check out how much this thing is. Okay, glass knife, 2,500. Look at that crap! Okay, we're gonna get that thing. I guess the last thing to do then is go ahead and use it. It actually feels like a good time, I guess, to go and get started, because I think the tenants do leave the home around about 8 to 9 p.m., so if we can get in before I guess the shirts proceed to come down, then we're gonna be good, and it gives us time as well to try and learn what this knife is all about. Alright then, guys, nice little parking right there. Yeah, okay. There you go. Okay, so she's already peeking out the window. Now would not be a wise time to hop over the fence. I need to mark the other tenant, though, because I'm sure I haven't done that. Okay, I'm getting impatient. She's taking too long. So I'm in here. I can use it. Should I try and mark him now? You know, he's looking away, so... Okay, T, mark it. Freeze! I'm telling you guys, these people are so shady. Who carries a gun around with them at all times and then proceeds to say freeze other than a police officer? All right, guys, so the plan is, I think, to break in through this way here. I don't even know how to use this thing. Let's try and learn on the fly. Um, uh, so I draw a circle. Okay. Uh, wait, what? The freak, why did it just pop up existence? What the heck was that? Hang on, let me try that one more time. So we hold the mouse button, click down, do the circle, I think, nice and slow, and then, uh, what, what do we do after? Uh, okay. The main thing is, guys, we're now in, uh... The freak is this down here? Open that. Okay, that was pointless. Ooh, so he goes out at eight. Now, I guess it's kind of a waiting game. We just got to simply wait. 
until I guess she goes out too, because we want to play this as safe as possible. This is like the first actual mission though, where it's kind of tense and you've got to play a little bit more strategically. Well, you actually have to wait. I guess for things to unfold in order to progress, which is really fun. Okay, so the garage door switch is there as well. Doing a little bit of scoping out whilst I got the time. She's probably gonna leave then, roughly now. This way. What are you doing? You checking your hands and your butt cheeks? They're probably fine, just get out of your house. Okay guys, she's about to leave and that means we now have free roam. She's left the house. Okay, and look at that, we're literally sealed inside of this thing. Let's go, man. House to ourselves, you already know we're about to do this. The landline, I've not ever taken one of those, so I'll take that. It should probably have some good loot as well. An X-Cube console. Uh, copyright, just say. Yeah, this place has the money right now, guys. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, so I don't know when they're actually going to be back, so I'm going to crack the safe ahead of time. This is so shady, though, you know? The whole setup for this place. So watch the noise levels. Be careful. Gotta be close. Okay, then we slow down. There's the first one. Go the other way. Okay, it's close again. I'm getting good at this, okay? I'm starting to now get this down. Here we go. This one here. And that's it, we're in. Open the safe. Bro, there is documents upon stacks of cash. What's that at the top there? A vase? What, why are you putting a vase in your safe? Unless it's worth a lot of money. Okay, another 50 there. Let's take a look around this place then for strictly money to begin with. I think that's going to be the best thing. What is that? Bruh. Uh, that does not look promising, so I'm going to leave that. The E-Brickson. Uh, okay, I'll take that, I guess. Take the other controller. And I think, you know what, I might be done here. Okay, the Samsung. Are you kidding? We'll get rid of the controller pad and we'll take the phone. Nice. Okay, I really don't want to overstay my welcome, guys, because I am getting a bit concerned. We're going to go ahead and leave. Let's do this. Here we go. Run a little bit. And that casual, because we are done. And we've got the goods. Guess parking the car here as well kind of has its benefits, because now all I literally got to do is start the engine, drive 10 meters, and we're good. Come on, how did I do? I didn't get seen once and look at all of the exp i'll take an a that's fine okay so how much will he pay 1200 1500 for the vase 700 dollars for the x cube are you kidding that is some absolutely insane loot right there guys i'm selling this crap seriously i won't buy this wipe it and then we can talk oh so we gotta learn a new skill then i suppose okay so the story says mark the camera in 101 which i think is the property just to the side so maybe we should look at doing that in just a sec so i've got two skill points as well at this moment in time and kind of getting close to the next one so i am gonna learn the backpack level two that means we've got a 50 percent increase in what we can carry. That's yes. a lot. I think as well, in terms of storage, I am gonna leave the Somes song because I can't unlock the thing or do anything to it just yet. That's a skill I gotta learn. Okay, guys, so I'm not gonna do the next mission just yet, but I wanna scope this out for the next episode. So this is 101. Holy crap. Okay, so there's the camera there, I guess. Mark that good stuff. Okay, Vinny's calling. You know to wipe a mobile, right? Say that you do. So this, I think, is to progress on, I guess, because I have already got the uh, Som Song. Bro, it just throws us straight in. I feel tempted to just try this right now. Okay, guys, we're going to give this one shot, okay? This might be interesting. Check around the edges of this house as well. Let me just see. Okay, so the camera is straight in front. Maybe I'll pick this and I guess just judge as time goes on what we got to do. Slide that good stuff open. <laughs> so you can see it's cone of vision. That's a lot. How am I even supposed to get around that? What about this thing back here? What is that? We can actually open this? I'd imagine this is to do with, I guess, disassembling the uh, thing. Mm. So simply pull that. We've got a time limit, so we've got four minutes to get everything done. Dude, we're going all the way right now. We are going to go ahead and do this because, uh, you know, why not? So climb the vines. Here we go. I feel like I shouldn't be doing this, but at the same time, screw it. I don't care. Go ahead, cut this thing. Come on. There you go. And then one more time. It should pop out, I think. There you go. Cool. Okay, climb in. There you go. No one is actually here. I think anyone's there. Okay, so all we're gonna do is take this thing and we're good. Guys, you already know we're slowly becoming the master of this crap as well. Okay, there's the first one. Go back on ourselves a bit. Okay, and it's probably gonna be that one there. And this one here. Come on, gotta be close. There it is. All right, so we take this and we're good. Okay, I'll take that. Wait, another one? Are you kidding? Dude, we are gonna make so much money once we learn how to, I guess, wipe the data on that stuff. Oh my god. Okay, give me that good stuff. Oh my god. I can't believe the tier of houses we're breaking into right now. We are seriously climbing the ranks, guys. This is amazing. Okay, the thing about this place, there is a lot of rooms that have been clearly opened, and I don't want to overstay my welcome. I don't actually have that long saying that. Wait, is anyone even home? It feels like I've actually done this mission at the perfect time. What is this here? What is that trying to say? Car alarm. Oh, so we don't want to go near that thing. Can I take the coffee machine? Because that's worth a lot. All right, you know what? We are done here. Discovered by a tenant. Oh, crap. You know what? We've got to go under here then. But then, what about after? How do we actually get out? Oh, God. This is really bad. I don't know what to do. Okay, I think it may just only alert the police. So we have got the time to get away after, maybe. Okay, don't you dare see me. Don't you dare see me. I think we're good. Bro, you can back up right now. No one's here. There you go. Good stuff. And the electricity is fixed up as well. God dang it, dude. 
This is risky. Okay, guys, I've seriously overstayed my welcome. We're gonna leave. Freeze! What the freak is wrong with you, man? He looked like the creepiest zombie character I've ever seen in my life. Okay, guys, we're gonna do this again, but I am not risking nothing, okay? I got what I need, and uh, yeah, I will take that as well. A Huey? Dude, I didn't even see that last time, so we are getting out of here. Okay, that should have been an S-rank thing, because I don't think anyone saw anything. Okay, it was a B, whatever. Okay, so Vinny's gonna call us again. What's poppin', man? What's going down? This tablet you got there is special. Wipe it and send it to me as proof. Sure, okay. See, the thing about this neighborhood now is it's starting to get a bit fishy. We're actually burgling things from people who appear to have been stealing things themselves. It's a bit strange, guys. It's a bit strange. For this one, though, guys, I am going to leave it here because I did record much longer than expected, and we got quite a lot of things done in the grand scheme. Next one, then, we're going to actually done the electronic skills, and I think after that, there must be some form of, like, car stealing thing you can do. It was displaying a car alarm, and I don't know why else it would do that. Anyway, though, guys, this is going to be it for this episode of Thief Simulator, and I hope you did enjoy. If you did, why not drop me that like, create, and hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe? for more videos just like this one right here. So thank you so much for watching this video, guys. I of course hope you did enjoy, and I will of course see you on the next one.